my name is Mandy Bradshaw and welcome back <laughs> for this vlog post I thought it would be best to have a video vlog that way I can show you better of what journals are and the different types that there are and I wanted to say first that journals are just one way to help yourself discover who you are and who you want to be and with the first journal I wanted to talk about was uh, just a simple writing journal and just writing in this every day maybe a page or two of just random thoughts uh, nonsense thoughts <laughs> just getting that chatter out of your head and onto a piece of paper it really clears your mind for the rest of the day and I also like to write a lot of questions in my writing journal. So I'll write, you know, what is it I want to do next in my life? Uh, and then I'll write out a bunch of ideas. And from there, later on, I can go back and find which ones I really want to do next. So I really enjoy having a writing journal. And I usually just have a regular notebook papered journal for that. So there's that one. Next one I wanted to talk about, uh, I use this one as like a research journal. Uh, so I have, I have a lot of artists that I like <laughs> and I will print off pictures that they've had and put them in this journal and then write down why I enjoyed their pictures so much. I've also done this with artists that I don't like. <laughs> And I just try to find one thing in their pictures that I did like. And this is one artist that I really enjoy. Her name is Susan J Durges. And I just absolutely love her pictures. She does something called photoless uh, or cameraless photography. And I still haven't figured that out yet. But. <laughs> There's that, and then I've printed off pictures that I have taken and kind of categorized them and kind of did like a little series, I guess, of them. And this one is of water flow and patterns and how water moves and the type of patterns that it takes. So your research journal can be, you know, just for anything. <laughs> uh, speaking of anything, this one is my everything and anything journal. Uh, I have writings in here. I have drawings, sketches, poems, and I've even got things of nature, <laughs> like leaves and... I think I have petals in here, and I also have, you know, oil pastels, because I love oil pastels, so this is one example. And with this, I really like having the, the blank pages, not having any lines or anything in it, because with lines, it kind of makes you feel like you have to just write in it. And with having a blank uh, paged journal, it makes you feel like you're free to do anything in it. So um, those are just a few types of journals that you can use. And you know, what I have in my journals may be different from what you have in yours. Just kind of play around with it and you know, See what you can discover about yourself and your artistic style, or even just about your thinking. Uh, so yeah, I hope this blog post has helped you in some way. And go ahead and leave a comment below if you have any questions or comments on having journals or if you're starting off having a journal. So I have an activity below also that you can try if you're 
just starting off journaling or even if you've journaled for a while so something to get you started <laughs> all right well you have fun journaling and i will talk with you soon